Si, what? what are you doing? I'm putting security camouflage on my shed. All right, whatever. Where's my auger? I've been robbed. What? Yeah, I've been ransacked, all right? I've been bamboozled. Ransacked? Yeah, ransacked, yeah. Ransacked? Hey, look, yeah, ransacked. They stole my stuff and your auger. They stole my auger? <laughs> yeah, they stole it. I've been traumatized. I've been violated. Si, I think I'm the one that's been violated here because they stole my auger. What are you talking about? All right, so lending an expensive piece of equipment to a man who can't even keep track of his own glasses, even though they're on his face, was probably a terrible idea. This is your security system, some camo netting? Well, hey, look, you gotta have something. That'll stop him. I'm not sure why he didn't just tell me the auger was stolen over the phone. But to be fair, he did mention something about miscreants and hoodlums flushing this nation down the commode. Ty, your shed doesn't even have a door. Well, it's got half a door. But I never really put the two together. I had some antiques in that thing. Look at that. No, it looks like they took everything good and left all the crap. It ain't nothing these dead gum rascals won't steal. They're the lowest of the low. Hey, this whole nation's going to the toilet. That shed's a toilet. No, it ain't. There ain't nothing wrong with that shed. Well, I don't think the camo netting's gonna help any. What's this nation going to? You gotta put chains and locks on everything? Yeah. yeah. Pretty much. That's pretty no. much what you do. I ought to be able to leave my shed unguarded, you know. You told me I gotta hire a security force around this darn place. No, I said just maybe get a shed with a door that locks. Look, boys, I'm gonna get the boys in blue. They get the forensic evidence, okay? Cops would just tell you to put a door in a lock. Well, I guess my auger's gone. I've been violated, I've been bushwhacked, I've been Amtrak and sidetracked. So si, you just need to bulldoze this whole thing. That thing's like one of my children. You don't put camo netting over your kids. Well, what are you trying to say here? You need a new shed. You gonna buy me a shed? Si, I'm not buying you a new shed. You're gonna you buy me about? an auger. No. But it was stolen from you. Yeah, but it was yours. All right, we'll split the difference. I'll buy it and you install it. That, what? I'm gonna get some other deal. What about my auger? The thieves took the auger. Okay, get over it. It's gone. How much did that thing cost anyway? A couple of hundred dollars. Eight hundred dollars? Yes. You paid eight hundred dollars? Yeah. Did you feel violated? No. You, you should have for eight hundred dollars. You're the one that should call the law for eight hundred dollars. You got ripped Good off. Great. Si, I thought we was here to get a shed. Yeah, we're gonna get a shed. Hey, this is the Fort Knox type shed that I need. Just think, if I'd have had this, you wouldn't have lost your auger. You know what I mean? No, I rarely know what you mean. Hey, look, this is the tall mahaj of storage units. It don't get no better. That's the slogan, boys. I like it. They've got little sheds that are nice. No, hey. It's better than a shed. It's better than a shed, just like he said. Si, what's your wife gonna say about this? Hey, she don't care. I wear the pants in the family, uh, all right? We'll see how that goes. Hey, I tried yeah. that. This thing keep thieves out? It's thief proof, solid as I say. Hey, the man has got a point. He's selling it, of course he's gonna sell no, it. No, hey. Wow. No. Hey, look, it's one thing I learned from the war, you can never be too prepared. There's no way we can move that thing. I got the truck, got the crane. Come on, man. And with the technology advancements and weaponry, we're more vulnerable than ever. What day you want to deliver it, sir? Hey, my shit, it's gotta be strong, just like me, okay? Fortified and full of crap. <laughs> you know people actually live in these now? Put them on a piece of land. And... No, they just yeah. kind of cool. Yeah, they do. Yeah, they do too. It's a hipster's dream. A hippie back in the 60s would have loved to have one of these. How would you go to the toilet? Oh, you just go outside after that. No, you just cut a hole in it. Oh, or that. We can put a bucket under it. Left, your left. left or my left? Your left. No, the other way. You need to turn it this way, Ty. Hey, quiet down in the peanut gallery. That's all. Whoa. Hey, look out now. The truck move? Yes. It's sinking. Oh, crap. Between my way. Better his than mine. Headache. Oh, headache. Headache. Whoa, whoa. Headache. I think she's a little front heavy. Hey, is the truck supposed to be off the ground? All right, bring it in for a landing, <laughs> boys. Shut up. You sure that's where you want it? Put her down. Oh, whoa. Good job. Perfect. What do you think? I think you're stupid, so. No, I mean, look at it. What do you think? It looks like a power truck. Does that rock and pop or what? 
and especially when I get them 50 caliber mine on. You talking about rocking and popping? Huh? Hey, we gotta put guns and ammo and food in this thing, so I'm gonna be ready. Ready for what? For the zombie apocalypse. What? Your yard? Welcome to the zombie apocalypse shed. Apocalypse? Yeah. The apocalypse. What's well, a zombie apocalypse? Jeff, did you tell me about zombies? Yeah. Look, don't be talking behind my back. Come over here and say it to my face. Jeff told me all about zombies the other day. Look, that ain't nothing but a metaphor for hippies. Si, the zombie apocalypse is not real. Yeah, Jeff told me you would say the apocalypse wasn't real. Look, hey, the hippies, OK, look, they was running rampant, OK? And they was, you know, stumbling and mumbling and shuffling all around. No matter what Jeff told you, it ain't real. Look, it ain't a matter of time, OK? It's when they're coming. Huh? It's like they lived out of some kind of shoe that smelled like a skunk. And I'm gonna be ready, buddy. That's scary. Hey, look, all you hippies out there, you mess with Silas M. Robertson, you're gonna suffer consequences and the repercussions. Good plan. I'm gonna be ready. All right, boys, we gotta get food and ammo on this thing ASAP. That means as soon as possible for you non-army guys. So uh, we know what ASAP means. Get the old shed in the new shed, then we'll eat. And it's on me. Yeah, I'm hungry. This is not a government job. Y'all are here to work. Hey, easy with that decoy guy was. You and Jeff, be careful with the uh, owl there. That's Sweet Pea's long lost brother. That's a white albino petrified cat. But be careful with him. He's priceless, boys. I found him when I was in Arizona. Got Mexico on it. They ain't got Mexico on it, you knucklehead. It says, it says Mexico, Mexico right here. What do you mean it says Mexico? Oh, that's all up. I oh. did it. Y'all killed albino? Good. <laughs> Cracked it. Is there any treasure in there? Boy, that'd been awesome if them dongs are in there. Do you still want this? No, you done killed him. Al's bit the dust, boys. Hey, look, I'm really enjoying my new storage container slash zombie shelter. This thing is cool, though, man. You can do all kind of stuff up in here. All right, check this out, boys. Hey, it's like an expensive pair of underwear, OK? Hey, it's good at holding all my junk. Give me a hand, Mark. A right here. Hand for what? The real question here, OK, is how's it going to do in a zombie apocalypse? OK. I have some kind of ventilation system. This place would be pretty cool. Wait. Installed. Hey. I know for a fact Jeff ain't a zombie. Uh... OK, but hey, let's face it. If there was a zombie apocalypse, OK, Jeff would be the first one to go. Let me out of here. Hey. I think he's turning, boys. He's infected. Infected with what? What? Zombie. Ha uh ha, -huh, real funny. Shut up, zombie. Let me out. He's saying something. Let me out, that's what I'm what? saying. He said, don't open the door. I might hurt somebody. Uh oh. Uh -oh. I got to get out of here, man. He said, you can't let me out of here, man. Yeah, he said, don't let him out. It's 300 degrees in here. He's already turned, boys. I he's can't hear. My eyelids are sweating. Hey, he's in the mutation stage right now. Seriously, guys, my crotch is getting swampy. All right, sir. All right, yeah. let him out. Let him out. This is definitely not a good place to live. I was totally wrong about that. I got a key here somewhere. Ty, seriously, it's hot, Ain't dude. Ain't no key going to help that. What That's a combination lock. Hey, what about a lock? Did y'all lock me in here? Uh-oh. Y'all done? Yeah, we're done. Did you lock the dang door? Shut up in there, zombie. Why is he locked inside uh, the container? I wanted to see if it worked. So, uh, oh, no, I'm serious, hey. And you don't know the combination? No, I don't know what that, hey. A dying a stupid container. I'm going to get some bolt cutters. Bolt cutters? Uh, I'm going to cut that know. lock off. Hey, that thing cost me $8. I'm getting bolt cutters. Willie, you can't cut it off. This is zombie quarantine going on here. I am not a zombie. Shut up, zombie. Well, what are we going to do now? I guess we're going to have to wait until Willie gets back with the boat colors. Well, I'm hungry. My eyeballs are sweating. Hey, look, I got some cookies at the house. Oh, oh some cookies, cookies, cookies. Yeah, fresh hey. baked, too, boy. You got Hold on, attention. Jeff, we'll be right back. Hey, we'll be right back. You want a cookie? Hey, where y'all going? That's good talk. Hey, I want some cookies. I need a bucket of water, too. All right. Day one, minute three. I'm so hot in here. Jess, stop making message. I love you. A lot of times when you said take the trash out, I didn't do it. I'm sorry. You're a good woman. 
wait at least a year before you get married again. Don't make any rash decisions, okay? And you better be cool and be a gamer and all that. So don't get some moron that my kids won't like. I love you. Ugh. Hey, y'all gotta get me out of here, man. These cookies are good. They are good. Mm. Woo! Hey, Jeff, I wish you could have had one of these cookies. Agua. What? Agua. He said agua. That's Spanish for brains. Hey, look, in every experiment, OK, there's got to be a test subject. All right, look. And Jeff made a good one today. You don't reckon he died, did you? No, he's undead, Gowan. This here was a quarantine test, OK? And it passed. Boys, I'm going to tell you what, this zombie Chair here, mm. pretty good investment. I need to go to the bathroom. Oh, yeah, it works. Well, he can't get out. Oh, that's that's sure. exactly right. That's what I wanted to make sure of. Uh, mm. I need to poop. This thing works so good, hey, I'm probably going to buy me 10 more of them for the front yard. Uh. Hey, plus, I like this with Jeff. Calvary's here, boys. You brought beer? No, Willie's here. Y'all got to get me out of here. All right, here we go, boys. Don't freaking bang on the door. He ain't gonna be able to do it, boys. Hey, yeah, uh, there you go, baby. Piece of junk. The light. I warned y'all. You okay? Is that him? Not funny. You was acting strange, son. What happened, bro? Did you pee in your pants or something? I just sweated through my boxers and my jeans. That's what I'd say, too. I'm dehydrated. Hey, look here. Got about two or three more things on the porch I need to put in here. Let's hurry up. I gotta go. Hey, by the way, your auger's in there. Are you freaking kidding me? It's in the back under a tarp. Sa! You don't freaking kid me. Hey! All right, boy, let's see if we got any more cookies left. Let me out! <laughs> Jeff, did you go to the bathroom? 